Good morning. We are here during our morning break of plenary session today, and I'm taking a few moments to chat with Hannah Park. Hannah is a first-time commissioner here at General Council, representing Manitoba and Northwestern Ontario Conference. So welcome, Hannah. Thank you. Hannah, can you start off by telling us where you're from and uh, what brought you to General Council? Um, I'm from Winnipeg, before then Vancouver Island and Vancouver and originally from Korea with my family. Okay. Um, I have my beloved home congregation um, that I serve, not home, but that, that I serve, um, Emmanuel United Church. So I would like to say to Emmanuel folks there, um, it's my great joy to be here. Mm -hmm. And so when you first decided to let your name stand as a commissioner for general counsel, what was the impetus? What inspired you to want to be a commissioner? Why did you think it was important? Because I believe that um, my voice matters, mm -hmm. even though sometimes it's hard to make my voice heard. Mm -hmm. So I think that decision making is a very important part of the church, and I believe that I can be part of it. Mm -hmm. So I took a took a way to come to here. Um, I worked with a few people to uh, support my proposal that um, from Manitoba and Northwestern Manitoba and Northwestern Ontario Conference, um, at least 20 people, hmm. uh, 20, um, 20 percent yeah. of the um, commissioners be the racialized members hmm. and indigenous and um, deaf, uh, deaf um, community members. Mm -hmm. So uh, I am I was under that category to finally come to here. So. Um, yeah, it's a moving journey, I would yeah. say. Yeah. So you brought forward this proposal to your conference to make this recommendation? Yes. Fantastic. And what was the response when you first worked with those folks to put forward this proposal? Were people encouraging of you to, to make that recommendation? I got the whole support from many people. Wow. So Wonder. It was something that uh, we could make, we should have made, and then it could help people to um, be part of this wonderful opportunity mm. to well, be part of the church. Absolutely, and we're so glad you're here and your voice is represented. So what have been some highlights for you of General Council so far? What's, what are the best parts? The best part is to see that uh, the possibility that, um, uh, as Michael Champagne said, mm. a two path can be one journey. Mm. And as Adri uh, Adrian Jacobs said, that now is the Kairos time mm. to, um, as one, uh, for us to be, as one United Church, um, uh, taking the steps to become one mm. um, from two past indigenous and settler churches. Mm. And I am um, proud that I am this historical moment, mm. which indigenous community really affirmed that it's Kairos time so that we can walk humbly towards reconciliation. Mm. Such an important moment. Mm -hmm. And other members of your family are also here. Yes. So your husband is part of the worship team. Yes. And your children are part of the children's program. Peace Kang and Javi Kang. And have they been enjoying it? So much. So they are taking the um, children's program um, that has been provided by the local, uh, local arrangements mm -hmm. of the Oshawa community. Um, what, I hear from every, uh, what I hear from them every night is that they can't wait for being, uh, can't wait for coming, going back to their program because um, they are so much fun, new friends to make. So um, that makes me confident mm. and comfortable because they are having fun, I'm having fun. Mm -hmm. So we're in the middle of a morning where we're voting for, not, we are voting for our next moderator of the United Church. How do you feel about this process, where, where we're at in the business process, about the work of the work of council? I feel that um, I'm not just alone. Mm. I'm bringing the voices and the hopes and desires from the community back in Winnipeg. Mm. I really bring their voices into here when I make the vote. vote. And I really hope that um, um, whoever becomes the moderator, the person will work towards reconciliation and uh, making the room for those who have been historically marginalized in decision-making body to be important and um, effective part of the church to make our church move forward. Well, thank you. Thank you for taking the time to chat with me today. Thank you for being here at General Council as a first-time commissioner first time. and uh, for bringing your voice and also representing the voices of so many across our church. So thank you so much, Hannah. Thank you. Thank you.